Have you ever had an idea for a Fortnite skin, but you never thought you could make it real? Well, uh, this will prove that you're wrong. This is an old article, but it says Ninja's reaction to Fortnite developers including a special plunger after he requested one. Shout out to Dextero for this, but it says, The way Ninja plays Fortnite makes it seem like the easiest game in the world, when in reality, it's incredibly difficult to score your first win. The former professional Halo player turned streaming god has been one of the major driving forces behind the game being so successful on the likes of Twitch. The Battle Royale shooter drops over 100 people into a large map, blah, 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 blah. This is one that's kind of new. They're obviously explaining it. It says Ninja's became unbelievably good at being the last one alive and had managed to win games with upwards of 30 plus kills which means he's involved in taking down almost a third of each server despite his praise of the game ninja has also been fairly critical about aspects of the game including the lack of skins to buy during one rant he said he'd even use a plunger and it appears epic games have granted him that very wish ninja reacted to finding out about the plunger whilst on stream <laughs> It's for me, dude. I said I would use a plunger and they stuck a katana in it. Also, he did a tweet about it. He said new featured items coming out of Epic Games, Fortnite Games, you trolls. I said I would use a plunger the other day. So what do they do? Stick a katana in it. Haha, <laughs> I love you guys. So as you guys can see, it can happen. Now you might be thinking, well, I'm not ninja, so I guess it's never going to happen for me. Well, that's where I can trump you yet again. Here's another one. This one's a little bit more recent. It says, watch, kid who designed Tinder Defender skin has a heart room reaction to seeing it in Fortnite. Night. so basically this kid fitted the skin he drew it um as you'll see here um in this image it actually got added to the game it says the kid who designed uh the tinder defender skin in fortnite finally got to see it in game and his reaction was priceless back in september reddit user tfost10 showed a photo that his eight-year-old son connor had a drawing saying that connor wanted to suggest it to fortnite developers the post picked up steam with over 40k upvotes and eventually epic games added it to the fortnite game during thanksgiving as you can see here's the image it says, dear fortnite please add a skin in fortnite called the chicken trooper has a drawing of it there was also more drawings of other than that and it says as the post got more popular connor's dad let the community know how excited his son was and that he started drawing more detailed pictures of his creation of course this is nothing compared to seeing connor's live reaction when he saw the skin appeared game Jeez, that was new. one yeah. second okay what's in the item shop and ooh, that's Wait, isn't awesome. that, isn't that the skin you what is that yours <laughs> what is that is that yours? It's yes. in the game! You did it, dude. Is that what it looked like? Yeah. Now, like I said, there is more photos to that that he actually drew that kind of had like the glider, the back bling. Like Fortnite took his inspiration and they made the skin out of it. So you should believe me now. Um, obviously, a lot of you guys probably seen both of them and probably knew about both of them beforehand. Now you actually seen them firsthand in this video. I wanted to get that out of the way. In today's video, we're going to be going over all of the best skins in 2019, some that are real and some that are ideas that hope to become real. Now, after you guys see the intro, obviously, you got to take ideas a little bit more serious. You know, if a skin comes out if a skin leak comes out if a skin concept comes out and you guys see tons of people talking about it well there's a shot that it's going to actually come into the game now i've never really done a video like this i've always wanted to and thought skin concepts were like such a cool idea you know here's the thing man there's developers at epic games obviously they do really good we always have new skins we have all this but there's like millions and millions of people that play fortnite so i think that there are some concepts that that you know you or i could come up with that would be good for the game and uh, i've always just thought it was so exciting so if you yes you listening to this right now thanks this is cool i need you to like the video right now like like no question the time is ticking I, I need you to like the video right this second also i heard if you subscribe in the next five seconds you will totally win a <laughs> So I want you guys to add to this conversation. Like I said at the very start, if you've ever had an idea for a Fortnite skate, a pickaxe, a glider, a back bling, anything, let me know what you would create. And if this video gets a lot of support, like I said, I'll make another one. Maybe I'll feature you guys' ideas in it. I think this could spread a lot of ideas. Obviously, you know, I don't know how many people are going to watch this video. Could be 50,000, could be a million, could be 3 million. I don't know, but I think we're going to get some good ideas from the comment section of this video. I I'm looking forward to that. So without further ado, I think I'm just going to kind of start talking about the skins. Now, I didn't bring every single comment concept that i've seen into this video because well quite frankly there's just a lot of them i kind of brought the more hype ones the more the more ones that i could see actually becoming real the ones that i could see there being a lot of hype around the one that i could see everybody probably watching this video wishes every single one of them would actually come into the game we're just going to go over them talk about them a little bit um now i want to say very quickly i think a lot of these actually came from like reddit or came from they came from somewhere right like someone actually designed these and uh at the time of like making 
watching this video most of them have been like stuff people's been using for like clickbait and stuff like that um some of these skins so i don't really know how to like properly credit it because it's like i didn't get these skins from reddit i got them from like people's thumbnails if that makes sense and i just hope everybody whoever invented this i love you i i i don't know who you are but i love you and uh i'm just gonna kind of talk about the skins i know so don't don't shun me okay the first skin which i think a lot of you guys have probably seen let me know if you guys have seen this yes or no we're talking about the frozen renegade now obviously as you guys know the renegade raider is uh one of the rarest skins of the game one of the earliest skins of the game and a lot of people were speculating the frozen renegade actually coming out obviously as you guys know recently we got the frozen legends bundle and i think that's kind of what inspired this skin also we have the raider's revenge which is the pickaxe it's also the frozen variant i think this skin would have been absolutely amazing now are they going to release this i don't know i i, I don't know if they want to release variants of like an og rare skin that they seem to be kind of trying to keep like that like imagine you know if they brought out a variant of like john wick people would probably be pretty mad i don't know once again like this is all about concepts i think this skin i i, I would buy this instantly I, I don't think anybody watching this video would disagree with that like this is an instant cop for most of us watching this video the second skin on this list i think is actually probably the one that has the highest chance to actually come in game you guys have probably seen some videos on this in the last couple of days we're talking about the kfc skin this actually i know where this one came from it came from a tweet from kfc basically saying that uh like they basically come up with this concept they're like let us know fortnite you know and they actually tweeted them and i think that there's a decent chance that kfc actually teams with fortnite to actually make a skin like this now i don't know if it'd be fully branded in kfc but maybe just like a chicken man something like this it was actually a pretty sick looking skin if you guys actually take a look at it i feel like it was maybe just like the uh the wild card skin with like the chicken bucket on its head but you know what it, it, it's a cool skin nonetheless i think most of us would buy it just because it's like kind of troll and like i said i could definitely see it being like the the more realistic one to to actually you know get into the game the next skin which is one i just kind of found it's called the death and essentially this skin is the raven skin but with like a a skull in the inside you can actually see it it's like red and black it's got a book and like a reaper stick i think this skin is absolutely sick i kind of just quickly like scrolled through a bunch of leaks uh, that i could find last minute for this video this was the coolest one or one of the coolest ones that i found i've never actually seen or heard of the skin before but honestly actually insane like yes it's a reskin of the raven but i would buy it i I would pay 2000 v bucks for the skin i would definitely buy the pickaxe i want the back bling you know like a book is a back bling that's actually sick dude. up next we have one that i think's been pretty talked about i think a lot of you guys have probably seen this honestly let me know would this make you mad yes or no if this came to the game we're talking about the white knight like the black knight except it's white where the black knight is black and red which is my favorite colors it this one is white and blue absolutely sick skin i would 100 percent buy this skin i just don't know if this would make people salty that's what i was kind of talking about earlier like if a new john wick came out would that make people salty because they have the john you know what i mean like i i don't really know if that's necessarily the way that fortnite wants to go if that would be proper i really think fortnite should just overall kind of look at skin concepts more and actually go with them i mean there's a lot of skins that are like very very hyped that if they dropped i mean just imagine the money like the, I, i've mentioned four skins here if these four skins came out like honestly out of them four skins how many would you guys buy so far I, i'm actually i'm generally curious i feel like fortnite would make so much money off of this up next we have one that's gotten a little bit of hype lately and i think this skin is absolutely insane i don't know who came up with this i don't even know if this is really a, a concept i guess it's just a reskin we're talking about the frozen ghoul trooper once again kind of came from the same concept of the frozen renegade obviously there was a frozen legends bundle they took a lot of old skins and just revamped them to like white and blue i think the frozen like raven is like so sick but i don't really like the raven skin much they did come out with the pickaxe for the red knight but i wish they would have came out with the pickaxe for the raven and the pickaxe for the uh the love ranger i wish they would have came out for pickaxes with them as well i think the frozen ghoul trooper is like everybody would buy it up next we have a skin that i think this one got leaked a long time ago obviously a lot of people requested this i just feel like this one will never come out uh because of a lot of restrictions probably due to like law and stuff like that i'm talking about marshmallow you guys know marshmallow played with ninja a lot they won some tournaments he's like the dude with the marshmallow helmet obviously you guys are seeing on screen now this would be a very very sick skin in game but i just think like marsh like i, I feel i've always felt like why have they not made like a ninja 
skin? Why have that not made like Tifu skin, stuff like that? I think the reason why they don't do it is because the creators of that, like Marshmallow, would want a percentage of the skin purchase. And at that point, like, is it really worth for Fortnite to do? These are just a few examples of what I could have brought up. But like I said, this is more of like a test video to see if you guys are into these kind of videos. Like I said, I love them. Like I absolutely love skin ideas, like skin concepts. I think it's so cool to see what could come into the game, but I know some of you guys might not like it. So if you guys did like this video, I think if you made it to this point, you probably enjoyed this video. Be sure to let me know, you know, leave it, leave a simple like on the video. Make sure you're subscribed. Uh, maybe even turn the notifications on if you made it this far in the video. And I'm actually curious if you think out of the six that I showcased in this video, if you think one of them would become real, which one do you think it would be? Do you think it would be the frozen renegade, the KFC skin, the death, the white knight, the frozen ghoul trooper, or the marshmallow? And I hope maybe this video inspired some more people to kind of get involved with it, kind of think of some ideas. But uh, yeah, guys, that is going to be a video for today. Thank you guys all so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this one. Like I said, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe with the notifications on and drop a big fat like on this video. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. I'm out of here. Peace.